Welcome to use Shelby products. Now let me introduce how to operate this machine. First, we need to install the software. Open the CD. Okay, now first we need to install the NC Studio. This software is used to operate the machine. Okay. The installation of this software is very easy. Now it's finished. Okay, it will be opened automatically. And uh, after we install this software, we need to set the parameters. You will get the, the parameters on this piece of paper, and uh, we will put these papers in the menu. Okay, now we change it. Okay, click apply and uh, then we change the manufacturer parameters. Here is the password. Okay, now the parameters have been finished. Okay, now we go back to the face. And then we can load a file. Click on Or we can click the click file. Open and load. Here we click. Now this is the J code. And now we can set the origin, the working start point. Click menu. And, uh, here we can we can move the spindle by clicking these buttons. This is X. Uh, uh, this time the moving direction is outside. So here we can do one thing. Press Shift, Control, and uh, Alt, same time. Then double click machine. Here is the uh, X direction. This one we change it. Now it's one we change it. Plus. Okay. Let me check. Okay, make it close and uh, restart it. Okay, when we click the left button, it will move to the left side. And when we click the right button, it will move to the right side. So it's correct. And then we check. Okay, it's correct. And uh, Y. Okay. Now we can set the origin. Okay, for example, we set this point as the uh, origin. Then this time, we can click the Z button to move the Z axis down.
put the Z axis until the knife just touch the surface of the material. Now it's okay. Then we click this working coordinate. We clear this coordinate. Then the point we set will be the origin. This time we can click the simulate button to the condition. Okay, this is the draw we want to do. Then we stop it. This time we can start the draw. First we reduce the speed. The feed rate. Then click start. Okay, you will see the spindle is rolling. Okay, come back to the computer here. You can see the the red dot, and here we will tell you it it's long, uh, limit lamp. Then this time we have to click operation and disable the mechanical limit and move the because the X X size touch the limit switch. So we move it to the opposite direction. Then close. Then we can operate the machine again. It's okay. And uh, uh, sometimes Sometimes when we uh, move the spindle, move too much, it will out out of the, the range. Okay, like this. Here we also uh, tell you appear this information and uh, tell you out of the limit. This time we need to click operate and uh, move to a re reference point because this is a uh, x axis out of the limit, so we only move the x axis to the reference point. Okay, come here and uh, here the warping coordinate is zero, but uh, sometimes it's not zero. Then this time we need to click it to change it to zero. Then this problem will will be disappeared. Okay, thanks again for select our products.